Okay, what is going on, guys? I'm sitting here in the middle of uh, El Dorado Maximum Gold Colombian Airport with none other than Patrick Hoban, of course, coming on? off a of fresh top 32 with this nice uh, win a mat he won. <laughs> and uh, of course, the shout out to RMC. Yeah. Um, but uh, how was your weekend? Uh, what did you play and uh, how good. did you do? I uh, played Despia, first time in Colombia. It was a really cool event. Um, yeah, let's show you. All right. Um, so I played two Aliber, um, two Tragedy, uh, Dramaturge, uh, and Ad Libitum for the Despias. And then I played three Adventure thing, one Griffin, I played two Fallen of Alabaz, one Kit, one Albion, one of the Tri Brigade, a Snow, and three Edgems. Then for the spells, I played uh, Triple Brand of Fusion. I played three Opening and two Red. I played three Patchwork, two Poly. Foolish, Gold Sark, Faithful, Draco Back, three rights, and three super polys. Uh, and Zero was, traps. Yeah, no traps, just all, you know, power cards. Um, this deck's pretty good at going second, though. Uh, and, like, when you play enough hand traps, like, the problem with hand traps is that I feel like if you draw one, it's like worse than drawing zero because then it's like they still did the same thing, but now you're playing with five cards instead of six. Um, and then if you play so many that you like consistently draw two, then you just draw really weird hands that can get interrupted easily. Um, so instead, I just played a bunch of like extenders and things like that over hand traps. Um, for the extra deck, I played three Albion. I played two Mirror Jade. Did the third come up a lot where you needed uh, to go through, like, cycling? Yeah, so the third one comes up just because the first turn you often use two, um, uh, just with the regular branded fusion play, and then the, the last one's, like, good for later on in the game. Um, I played two Lubelius, um, one Tri Brigade. So I was fine. Um, I used it multiple times, but it was, like, at points where I was already winning. So I don't know if the card was necessary. Um, I played two Masquerade. Um, Masquerade is definitely one of the highlights of the deck this weekend. Yeah, that's um, how I lost to Andres. You made double Masquerade. <laughs> yeah, if you if you put up two first turn uh, with like a couple interruptions, it's it's really hard to beat because the right cards are like so many cards in, in a row. They can only play like seven cards before they just die. Um, and so if you have like any interruptions to stop like the Draco back bounce or anything like that, it's really strong. Um, then I played two Chimera. I only saw the second one once, um, but it, I think it was probably fine. Uh, then I played two of the Predator Plant Fusions. Um, this card was good. Uh, I played four Flunder decks. So, uh, you know, having like a fact that like cards is pretty good against the Flunder decks. Um, I also played Super Poly, so this was like more targets for it as well. And then I just played one card. And that was the extra deck. Um, for the side deck, I gave some cards back. So, <laughs> uh, I played one of the Prank Kids Fusion as a Super Poly target. I played one Guilty Gear Freed to be able to out the uh, Baron Phoenix Enforcer's Lifelock. Um, then I played a Reboot. I played three Twin Twisters, but I gave two of them back. Um, I also played three Bell, but I gave one of them back. Uh, I played Harpies in Zombie World and Banshee. And then I played three Crow. Which I also gave back. How was Crow? <laughs> uh, I didn't play any Despia Mirror, so yeah. I didn't really decide to do very much. <laughs> All right, well, is there anything else you want to say? Any other shout outs? Or? Uh, shout out to RMC. Um, shout out to Lily. We talked about this deck a lot. Um, yeah, I don't know. It's good to be back. I, I didn't play for like four years, so. All right, it's a great feeling. <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> All right, well, we'll see you next time. Awesome. See ya.